published 6.20 Eastern Standard Time, the 7th of March 2018, updated 7.06 Eastern Standard Time, the 7th of March 2018 Warren Gatland has ripped up his Wales starting 15, making 10 changes for the Italy match this Sunday, including handing the captaincy to Taoluk Falatau for the first time. The 70 cap number 8 makes his first appearance of the tournament and comes straight in to start and skip for the side. Alan Wynne Jones is rested and does not make the 23 man squad at all. It is a great opportunity for Taoluk, he is a world class player. Hugely experienced, and this will be great for his development, and we are looking forward to seeing those leadership qualities come through, said Gatlin. Taoluk Falatau will captain Wales in Sunday afternoon's Six Nations clash with Italy in Cardiff after the 37-27 defeat to Ireland in Dublin ahead. Coach warned he would make alterations, and he has kept to that promise with only one forward and four backs surviving. George North is one of the new starters, he will make his first Six Nations start since last. March against France, after controversially missing Northampton Saints defeat a sale in the Premiership last weekend. His appearance means that Liam Williams shifts to back where he excelled for the Lions against New Zealand, and Lee Hapenny drops to the bench. Steph Evans, a try scorer against Ireland, is retained along with fellow Scarlets Gareth Davis and Hadley Parks. But Owen Watkin replaces Scott Williams at number 13 and Gareth Anscombe comes in at fly half. In the pack, there is an entirely different front row. Nicky Smith and Thomas Francis are the props either side of Elliot D. The 24-year-old poker makes his first test start. Corey Hill is the only forward kept in place as Bradley Davis comes in for Jones, Justin Tipuric. Plays in the unfamiliar position of blindside flanker and James Davis makes the long-awaited debut at open side. The 27-year-old is an electric talent and cut his teeth in sevens, winning a silver medal with Team GB at the 2016 Rio Olympics. Scarlet's flanker James Davies, pictured in action against Bob, is set to make his test debut. They have made some changes, but we are bringing in a lot of quality and a lot of experience with the likes of Bradley Davies, Justin Tipura, George North and Taoluk. Add into that James Davies who gets his first cap, Elliot D who gets his first start, this is a great opportunity for them to play tournament rugby, it is challenging making changes, but we have picked a really exciting team and Sunday is the chance, Gatlin can afford to make this many changes as he looks to find the perfect formula for the World Cup in 18 months time, as Wales are out of the running in the Six Nations having lost twice already, to England and Ireland. And despite plumping for a team that has never played together before, his new look lineup does still boast 424 caps worth of experience and four test lions, with two more in Ken Owens and Hapenny on the bench. Wales have not lost to Italy since an embarrassing 23-20 defeat at the Stadio Flaminio 11 years ago. They have scored 20 tries in the last three matches against the Azzurri Whipping Boys, and with this side it looks like free and fast is the desired style for Sunday's match. Wales head coach Warren Gatland has made 10 changes following a 37-27 defeat by Ireland.